Okay, uh, so let's start the lesson number two, which uh, will be about the code blocks uh, itself. Um, the code block, it's the if you if you want to open it, it's a double left click on the empty space on the board. Uh, code block is the basic unit of uh, designing uh, in the Dynamo. Uh, you can either use it uh, as an input, like for example, you can put there a number, integer, or a double. Mm, um, doubles are with the dot. Or either you can um, uh, and also you can um, create a list with the code block. Uh, let's start from the uh, simplest list, which is from 0 to 1, and with the step 0 0.1. Uh, right now, if you want to see how the... Uh, I will just turn on the, uh, uh, the automatic option of the running, because uh, the algorithm which we will be creating will not be heavy. Then, uh, if we want to see uh what uh, this code block created it created a list with um, 11 elements uh, see that indexing uh, it's starting from zero it starts uh, with the first uh, zero and ends with the one this is one way of creating a list if we would like to control um, you can control c control v copy paste the uh, code block if you would uh, you would like to control uh, not the step uh, in the list but the number of the element in the list you uh, have to type hash and then uh, add the number of the elements this one as you can see create um, exactly the same output um, as uh, previous one if we would like to what is nice about uh, code block? It's using uh, codes. Uh, it's not um, just an input. It's uh, script syntax. We can, uh, instead of using a constant number, a constant uh, a double or an integer, we can uh, put here a variable, which means for uh, which uh, right now let it be a, and then he's expecting us for giving this uh, number. And then uh, we can use um, more time uh, uh, code block. We can either like that um, and just give him the integer which he expect. And then uh, he's reacting uh, automatically on the change of the code block. The um, different type of the input uh, can be the slider. You can either use number slider or integer slider. Uh, one more time. Uh, what is the difference? Number is more. Uh, number slider is of course more universal one. Uh, integer, uh, you are not able to create uh, uh, doubles in the number slider. You of course can create. Uh, you can make from the number slider an integer slider. So. Uh, if we connect it here, then uh, we have the very flexible or user-friendly control of the number of the elements in the lists. Um, what's, uh, we can uh, put uh, more variables to the code block. Uh, we can generally put as many as we want. So if we go A to A uh, to A3, now we can um, control, for example, the minimum value of the list, the maximum value of the list, and the number of the elements. Let's do it like this. Uh, like this. So we are creating um, nine elements in the range uh, from 0 to 11 in the list. Yes, thank you.